Hi guys, so today I am going to be unboxing Day 6's Shoot Me Youth Part 1, both the bullet and trigger versions. This album is one of my favourite mini albums of the year. I, I've i loved the day, like that has always been my favourite Day 6 album and I never thought that I would get another album from them that would top it just because that album is like so ingrained into my heart and I loved it so much. But this, this one is definitely a contender. Um, I love it as much as, if not more than the day. So, yeah. It's kind of a departure from their usual sound. It's definitely heavier, and I really appreciate it. <laughs> um, let's start with the bullet version. shoot me and the track listing here okay so there are seven tracks on this album and they are warning shoot me the title track Ochora Boni somehow feeling good Honja Mal talking to one Hanika still and shoot me instrumental which is only on the CD so um I love this album, I already said that. It reminds me of the stuff that I used to listen to when I was like 14 or 15 years old. So it gives me, it makes me feel very nostalgic. I think that's one of the reasons that I really, really love this. Um, I also got to see them in concert uh, last month or like in August. And um, it was like one of the greatest experiences of my life. Um, definitely one of the best concerts that I've ever been to. And um, they actually performed Warning, Shoot Me, and Otora Boni there, and they were amazing. I really love Warning, but my two favorites on here are Shoot Me and especially um, Otora Boni somehow. Um, I've loved that uh, song since the first time that I heard it, and I still love it. And though I listen to the whole album a lot on repeat, I have to admit that I listened to Shoot Me and Somehow the most and I, I remember when I when this album first came out, those are the two that I really listened to the most um, and I still do. <laughs> so I alternate between them a lot but I do love this album as a whole a lot. It's just really, really, really good. That's all I can say. I just love it so much. I'm going to take out this, oh, there's stuff in it. <laughs> Straight up. I'm going to take out everything in here. I think that was it. And yeah, we have Shoot Me. On the CD. And then the photo book, which just slides out of here. Cute. I don't think there's anything in here. I think everything was already on. Yeah. Everything came in the front. Yeah, they were just so incredible live. I loved every everything about it um i love k-pop i love idols and obviously dance routines and um i'm sorry choreography and everything but there's just something about seeing a live band that gets at me and they were just so incredible they made me feel all the feelings I also got to high touch them, which was amazing. <laughs> and I've always, I was a J um, fan. And then I like, I was always J biased and then I became one pill biased. But then Song Jin kind of stole my heart a little at the concert. So like, I don't know what I am anymore. <laughs> Mm, 
And there was like a moment when they all came into the crowd as well and it was so good. It was so incredible. I also really think that somehow was probably one of my favorite um, songs of the year. I almost, I almost cried when they performed it. I was just so like emotional. <laughs> Also, they look amazing in person. Thanks to... and that is it for the shoot me uh bullet version photo book just gonna put it in here first and then go through the stuff that it comes with okay actually both of them came with um these standees which i forgot to go through i think they they're pre-order standees Um, they're both, like, the same standees, so I'll just go through this one set. But, we had Sungjin and Jay. Youngkae. I don't know what this pose is. <laughs> Wonbil. And Doon. So yeah, Sandy's. Because of course they're JYP, so they come with lots of like extra pre-order type stuff. Okay, and other stuff it comes with. So there is a sticker. Is it a sticker or like a tattoo? Maybe it's a tattoo. That would make more sense. Yeah. Like so, like the stick-on tattoo thing. And. This, like, um, one of the plastic things, and this is, hang on, let's see if this works better. If it focuses, it's J. Yeah, <laughs> it's J. So that's cute. Um, and other stuff, so there are two photo cards. For the first one, I got one pill. My bias, I think. <laughs> so yeah, one pilly. And, um, but I don't collect day six. I'm trying not to collect day six. So I will put uh, my photo cards up for trade or sale. The second photo card I got is... Oh, I got J. Uh, I always end up getting, like, the members that I love the most, J and Wampil, whenever I pull day six things, and it's just, like, tragic that I don't collect them. But yeah, I'll move all of this out of the way and go straight into the trigger version. Again, I'm going to take everything out first. And here is the CD. So 
So this one is black. photo book. This comes out of this again. Oops, let's see if you do that in properly. Oh, that's such a beautiful picture. <gasps> Look at one pill. Can I just say that one pill and Dawn and Song Jin speaking English is the cutest thing in the world and I love them. Also, whenever Jay can't like translate something <laughs> and he has to get Young K to do it, I love that too. This is such a casual photo shoot, but the styling is on point. Credits again, and that is it for the trigger version of photo book. Um, I will go through the cards again, um, and I have another set of the standees, so I don't know what to do with these. I'll probably put them on um, sale or trade or something with them, because I don't really need another one. But for the like transparent thing, I got... I can't even see. Who is this? Is it Wampil? I think it's Wampil. You can kind of see. Try and focus it a little. Yeah, that's Wampil. Again, I always get J or Wampil. <laughs> I've been getting them a lot recently. And again, the tattoo thing, which is cute. Okay, so for the first card, I got... I got J. J's card. Which is really cute. I should not collect them. I should not collect them, but I want to, but I shouldn't. And for the other card, I got... I got Jay again. Oh my gosh. It's like the universe is telling me to collect Jay and Wompu because I keep pulling their cards and I'm like, I don't collect them, but... Uh, I don't know. I don't know what to do anymore. <laughs> um, but yeah. Uh, like, day six are just such, so important to me. I've loved them since debut, since congratulations, and I've, I've loved everything that they've done. I'm so glad that they continue to, like, you know, 
change up their style and do new things because you like this album is totally different from the stuff they did in like Sunrise and um, Moonrise and stuff and I loved that I loved the whole project last year but I'm so excited to see what they're gonna do moving forward because we know this is only part one and Young K is like just a genius and can make like the best songs and I love him so yeah I'm, I'm so excited to see what they're going to do in the future and yeah thank you so much for watching